My name is Eli. I work at Ford, and here's my box. I just got a little cheap Husky box from Home Depot for about 400. Uh, this is my top drawer. It's just like miscellaneous nuts and bolts, nut removers, uh, drill bits, just some miscellaneous stuff like caps and stuff like that. Got my flashlight, air gun. I got my Phillips heads and my flat heads, some good old brake lube. Uh, and then on this drawer, I just got some wrenches, torx bits, X keys, just a little bit of quarter inch ratchets, got some Matco, some wire brushes. And this drawer, this is what we use mainly for changing oil and stuff. I got my 3-8 sockets, shallow, deep. Then I got my impact ones for my Milwaukee. Uh, I got my deep well impacts. Got a range of extensions. Got a few different ratchets. I got a Matco, Pittsburgh, and another Pittsburgh. This is a little longer. I've got brake tool, some spark plug sockets, and some, a filter socket. Uh, in this drawer, I got some of my wrenches. I just got some snap on ratchet wrenches, some pliers, locking pliers, vice grips, and some clear nut wrenches or brake lines and stuff like that. I also got some wire brushes, and then I got this uh, AC Delco 3 8 torque wrench. And in this socket, we use a bunch of this for brakes and stuff like that. And also, uh, for lug nuts and stuff like that. We've got these impact sockets with these protectors. These basically just protect rims so they don't get damaged when you're doing it. I got my Matco torque wrench. It's a little bit longer. It helps get some leverage when you're torquing lug nuts or anything. It goes up to like 360 foot pounds. Got a long uh, half inch ratchet. A bunch of impact sockets, short, deep. And then I also got my chrome ones. And then in this drawer, I just got some of my power tools, speaker, uh, pad service kit for the rear brakes, air gauge, air gun, uh, some Milwaukee batteries. And then these are very helpful. They're, uh, they're a lug nut socket set, but they've got like half sizes and everything. So when chrome cap lug nuts get swollen, it just helps out with removing them because they like to get a little bigger since they're swollen. And then I got like a just rubber mallet, stuff like that. And then I got like grabbing tool and stuff like when you get something stuck. And yeah, that's about it. And Snap-on, Maco, Cornwell, Milwaukee, which one? I'm choosing, well, for, for hand tools and stuff, probably Snap-on, but the price is a little up there. But Milwaukee, I definitely go for them for any electric tools because it's just the best bang for your buck. Yeah. All right, man. That's my boy Eli, tool, toolbox tour. You know what I'm saying? He put me on everything. But yeah, man. Y'all stay blessed, stay focused, have a good day. I always remember you a while. Make sure you like, leave a comment down below. It's your boy Kendra1K, and I'm out.